Thanks to Gray for those early races, and I'll kick straight in then with the big one of the day, the 1,000 guineas. A, the first classic of the season, of course. It's over a mile, it's for the Phillies. And it's over a mile at Newmarket. Three-year-old Phillies, and at the top, Almindra for Darren Thompson. Bountiful Sea for Leon Van Rensburg. Canada Dry, Paul Rhodes. Cribbits, Darren Thompson. Monge, two. And Melchborn for Martin Lidham. Nabadat, Susie for David Robertson. Nice Grey. David Hooley, nicer grass. David Robertson, perfect diva. Paul Rhodes, she's still broken. Joshua Sutherland, swift focus. Moonass, vertigo for Derek Hinton. Waltz in night for Jim Harrison, the favourite. And Yonkers strikes for Vinnie Gerard. 15 of them then. Big field, heavy ground. Rain still coming down. I think one or two of their away. And racing one or two have taken their chance based on the ground, I would guess. And... It's Yonkers Strikes is the first one to show in the green jacket for Vinnie Gerard, but Vertigo is coming through the challenge now. Also, Monge 2 is up there the pace. He's not that hot, and Monge 2 on the inside has gone on into the lead, but now being taken on by She's Still Broken. So She's Still Broken has gone on from Monge 2 and Waltzy Knight. Bountiful sees next, then Almendra looking towards the back. Yonkers Strikes has now dropped right out the back. The grey over on the far rail is nice grey, and that one is towards the back as well, but She's Still Broken is the clear leader. They're through three furlongs already. Five to race. And She's Still Broken leads the Guinness field. From Bandival Sea up the centre of the track. Almendra is in third. Then Canada Dry Walks in Night Swift Focus and Cribbage. Not out busy. Monge 2 and Nicer Grass trying to get into it as well. There's nothing out of it yet. But it's She's Still Broken who leads by about a length and a half to Bandival Sea. And he's now set go on that one with three and a half furlongs to go. Quickly Canada Dry's come through to challenge. Now Yonkers Strugs is getting back into the four again. Almendra Mendra is still there. Krivitz is also not out of it, but she's still broken. Continues to lead. Now Yonkers Strikes goes into the lead, and Yonkers Strikes has kicked on in front. Yonkers Strikes in front. She's still broken. Bandit will see. Canada try trying to get into it. Al Mendra and Krivitz in. Nada Hat Susie. Suddenly they start a bunch up front. Bandit will see. kicked on again. Bandit will see the lead as they hit the final furlong into 1,000 guineas. It's Bandit will see from Nice and Grass. Al Mendra's coming through. Nice and Grass is now taking it up. Al Mendra, Krivitz, and then Nava Hat Glory. Then Nice and Grass. Canada dry now comes. No Cribbits, it's Cribbits over on this near side. Cribbits will stay again. His Cribbits wins it. No, that Susie's next perfect diva. Finished like an absolute train. And if that's Matt Cooper, that's his best ever finish. But um, some of the colours get duplicated in the flat. And it's Cribbits who's taken it for Darren Thompson. And Cribbits is the winner for Darren Thompson, Nabadat Susie, David Robertson second, Canada Drive third for Paul Rhodes, perfect diva, Paul Rhodes in the colours of Matt Cooper was fourth, nicer grass for David Robertson was fifth, so it's a guineas win for Darren Thompson, so went to one of the more usual trainers, but maybe not with a horse he expected it to, as the heavy going and all a bit different, one or two trainers you wouldn't expect to be up there close to the top. But it's a first classic of the season, goes to Darren Thompson.